Hello and welcome to Retro Bikes Dublin. Today we're looking at a gorgeous example of a 2004 Ducati ST3. The name comes from there being three valves in uh, the cylinder. It's got some really nice Showa front and rear suspension. That's from standard Brembo brakes. Uh, and like I said, only 17,000 miles from new. So it's a, a low, a low uh, mileage example for the type of bike that this is. Uh, overall original, uh, original exhaust, everything like that. A few little marks around it, but like I would say as good as you're gonna get for a 20 year old bike. Tires at the front here are good. And, and they're Michelins. Front, there's your, your, your proper front suspension there. Front plastics all looking really nice and tidy. Up over the top, you've got a little few marks here on the mirror. Um, on the right hand side is worse than the left hand side. We've got uh, the plastics all the way down on the right hand side, pretty good. This is a little minor mark here. Front discs, nice big front discs. The alloy itself is in really nice condition. A little bit of a scuff here. Um, all the way through, all, all nice. Engine is in really nice condition. Uh, the tank itself, nice condition on right hand side. Uh, the seat is perfect, no rips or tears. Up over the top then, no imperfections. All the switch gear, all in nice condition. Master cylinder for the Brembo brakes. Um, at the rear here then, everything looking really nice. We have a little bit of damage here on the paint. Uh, on the grab rear grab rail and um, but if you really wanted to paint anything that's the easiest thing to paint get that done rear tire here good as well and see there all very nice original Ducati exhausts we, these are uh, non fanjo um, kind of pillion and um, uh, pillion uh, what you call it uh, boxes uh, to put that on have again all original down the side a little bit of a uh, few little scrapes on the exhaust here on the left hand side chain and sprocket looking nice as well uh, throughout nicely lubricated well maintained bike it's got a quick release charge uh, uh, as well for charging the battery if you're gonna let it sit uh, tank is in nice condition overall front front fairing here on this side, on the left hand side, all very good. And uh, that's kind of it. Everything other than that is uh, really, really spot on. So we'll go for a little spin. Okay, next we'll take out is the ST3 from Ducati, low mileage. This little mark there I might've missed in the visual, but nothing major. Really nice bike overall. First thing I notice is a low sitting position relative to the size of the bike. My knees are very well bent. Um, you know that's a that's a that's a nice to have a little bit of choke a nice half digital dock or, or or dash I should say half a tank of fuel as well which is good to know the new owner will be getting a few hundred kilometers there really easy to ride there's over, I think it's 107 brake horsepower, so it's a fairly nippy bike. Certainly from a twin, you get a lot more of that torque. So overall, quick bike. I think people's idea of what, what is quick and what isn't quick anymore is crazy. Kind of, um, if it doesn't do, if it doesn't do zero to 60 in, 1.9 seconds nowadays for whatever reason that's a that's a slow but that's a slow bike oh lovely ridden one or two of these in the past a very very comfortable bike and a bit of style a bit of a, a bit of a name to it you know Being a, being a Ducati in bright yellow. Really feels planted to the ground. Brakes feel really, really strong on the front, those big Brembos. Doesn't feel too heavy as well overall, which is good uh, considering the size of the bike.
going through all the gears nicely clutch feels nice and light it, it is adjustable as well which is nice to see what i will say is it feels like there's lo loads of power in every gear you can really the torque that is down low is uh crazy considering the bike goes up to 11,000 rpm although i'd say that's pro a little bit before that was red line but really really nice power throughout and uh, I don't know if those neighbours giving out about me, but maybe they are. And temperature gauge there coming up nicely. Kind of typical to, uh, to a Ducati, they don't particularly love doing uh, low speed things. Although it might just need to warm up. But under under 10 miles an hour is not, uh, not where it wants to be. It really just wants to give it more power straight away but we'll put it up here do all the indicators everything like that put it into neutral really easy to find neutral <laughs> horn working and uh, i'll put on the high beam as well for you guys and the hazards so high beam on indicators front and uh, left and right of the front working indicators left and right working as well and rear brake light working also so that's all the electrics bike running really nicely going through all the gears uh, looking lovely as well idling good braking front and rear tires good really really nice overall so if you have liked the video up until now it would be greatly appreciated if you like comment and subscribe and if you do want to reach out to us on our socials they are at retro bikes dublin for facebook and instagram and our official website is www.retrobikesdublin.com thanks for watching